What's up guys? This is going to be our room tour for our interior room um, on deck 7 on the Carnival Glory. This is room 7300 if you guys are interested in thinking about booking an interior room. Fantastic room location. Let me tell you, this room is super convenient, super close to everything. So, you go up two decks and you're on Lido deck. You go down two decks, you're on deck five, the main promenade where everything is at. Like I said, Lido up, that's, you know, that's your buffet, that's your pizza, guys, burgers, blue iguana, the pool, so much more, guys. So much access to everything up there. So, deck seven, the perfect, perfect deck on this ship, the Carnival Glory. There's not a galley above you or below you, so you're not getting, there's no theaters above or below you. Perfect room location for us. Um, 7300, if you're looking for that nice quiet room, this is the one to book, okay? So I'm going to give you an in-depth room tour now, uh, so you guys can really get a feel for this room. You ready? Come on, let's go. So like I said guys, this is cabin 7300. Now when you walk in, you will immediately notice that the room does seem very large. Um, we did have them separate the beds. Now I'm filming this video at the end of our cruise, so that's why we have all of these towel animals that we made, or that our room steward has made rather. She was super nice. But immediately coming in, you'll have three closets on your left. So um, a very nice large one for some miscellaneous storage. And maybe if your suitcase didn't fit under the bed, you could store it right here. Nice big space for that. So some tiny storage underneath, maybe a smaller bag, and then you have storage up there. A couple coat hangers in here. You can always ask for more coat hangers. Your room steward will be able to give you those. Just dial the extension that they give you. <clears throat> Next up, we have a second closet. Plenty, plenty, ample amount of coat hangers in here. Um, this, this closet did the job for all of our formal wear, and I think most of our clothes as well. So. Uh, perfect spot for that. Life jackets up top, of course. Hopefully you will never have to see those other than in passing. And then a shelf down here. Um, we placed our shoes on this shelf and this shelf down here as well. Again, another nice small storage area. <clears throat> And the third and final closet, this is more of for stacking clothes. You have a bar up top. If you did have any small um, hanging like shorts or anything, you could hang those right there. And then you have one, two, three, and then a bottom shelf. So total of four shelves for you to stack stuff on there. Maybe three and your shoes could go down there. But this was ample storage. This room definitely met our needs. We have a nice countertop here. We ended up actually stacking all of our towel animals on the countertop and the uh, table provided here. <laughs> Just to, you know, <laughs> I mean, look, we have tons of towel animals, so we had to have someplace to store them. But uh, the new Effie line, uh, Carnival recently partnered with them. So we have the new Effie magazine in room, front of shore, that one's not new. Style for All and Park West Art Auction magazines, all there for you. Next up down here we have the refrigerator. Uh, comes nice and cold. Does not come with uh, ice and water unless you are a returning member. Yes, now if you do want ice in your room, all you have to do is ask your room steward. We did, so that's all we did. We just went to her and said, hey, can we have a bucket of ice? And every time that we come back in our room, there is fresh ice glasses there for you to use. Now, coming over here, we have the nice big flat screen TV. Uh, this is the updated Carnival TV, so nice and flat. Then we have a drawer up top. We're just using it to store the GoPro, and then of course you do have your hair dryer. Oh, there's the high speed. Next drawer, some smaller things. You can store some underwear, some socks, that kind of thing in there. One, two, and three. Three drawers right there for your storage. A nice stool underneath with your beach towels. Guys, remember, you can take those beach towels out when you go ashore. Those beach towels are allowed to be taken out of the room. Just remember, bring them back. Um, a healthy amount of counter space right here. Um, filled up all of our needs from charging stuff. Now, here's a, here's a returning cruiser. Big tip for you. Make sure you always bring one of these bad boys right here, a power strip. Now, note a surge protector and a power strip, okay? There are there is a difference. Make sure you read yours. Surge protector is a no, power strip is a yes, okay? So make sure you do bring that along. You're gonna need it, especially if you're a filmer like me. You know, you have you have the main camera batteries, you have backup main camera batteries, then we have drone batteries, then we have GoPro batteries, then we have cell phones, then you have Apple Watch. I mean, it just gets like crazy the amount of stuff that you have to charge. So definitely going to need a power strip to provide all of that power. Now you have a uh, 
room room phone that you can dial all the you know the main main important stuff like medical steakhouse room service medical center housekeeping guest services wake up call and just a message so if you did have somebody that leave you a message that one would be blinking we have two split twin beds here ample storage underneath um, it's a really good height. It was able to fit large suitcases. We have we have one large suitcase and it slid under there, no problem. So uh, ample storage there. Then you have, of course, the more storage right over here, underneath. Nice lamps. Oh, oh, do we have an outage bulb? There it goes. Ha! <laughs> and again, storage under here, same his and hers respectively. A nice convenient wall switch here. I'm not going to press it because it takes forever for the lights to turn back on. That's the only thing. I think these are like fluorescent. Yes, they are fluorescent. So it takes them just a minute to turn back on. You do have temperature controls here. They do work in this cabin. It did actually work. So if you turn it up, it will get hotter. If you turn it down, it will get colder. Going into the bathroom now. This is a standard carnival bathroom. So you can poop, you can wash your hands, and you can shower all at the same time. It is, uh, there is not a, there is not a healthy space in between the toilet and the shower, but it does the job. Uh, of course, extra toilet paper and, uh, tissues down there if you need them. Two water glasses, soap, and your basic one, two, three shelving units a piece. One, two, and three. Shower, and of course, provided soap. So, that is pretty much the room tour. Once again, this is cabin... 7300 7300 perfect cabin perfect location guys if you're thinking about coming on the carnival going this is the cabin that you need to be in if you're looking for an interior option back to our regularly scheduled vlogs <laughs>